on these A series envelopes with the square flaps, this line right here represents the fold line of the flap. It's important that when we're hand inserting these pieces that the envelope is tapped down to get the, the insert all the way down to the bottom of the envelope. Because of the concept of how this, this machine works is when it comes through this, there's a mechanism in there that actually cracks the flap and opens it up for sealing. Properly adjusting the gate, uh, the separating device, we first put one envelope underneath the, the O-ring separator, take the second one, put it underneath there and slide it back and forth and lower the gate until you start to, to feel the resistance on the top piece. Uh, that way one piece will be allowed to pass through and the second one with that resistance is going to hold it back. We also want to make sure that the envelopes are the top of the edge of the envelope is up against the back plate. With that in place we're going to loosen up the side guide, slide it into the envelope, put a little bit of clearance in there and then lock it down. To properly load the envelopes into the hopper, you want to tap them down, put a slight angle to them. The flap is on the back and down. From there you'll take the stack and just set it right into the hopper. That way you can see that they follow the, the wedge on the back as well as around the gate cylinder in the front. When we're adjusting the wedge, it's held in place by this angled bracket on the bottom. You can simply loosen it and move it back and forth. We found that a proper wedge adjustment just is enough to hold the envelope up off the deck with a little bit of play on the bottom. So it's important when you're feeding envelopes that the top side of the envelope is against this back side of the feeder and you can see that envelope following all the way down. When it hits this mechanism, this is what actually cracks the flap and opens it up for sealing. We're going to bring it right through there and it, again it, we're holding it right up to the edge.